Yes. Oh, I was tether stalling so many people out. It was so cancerous. <laughs> um, but now we have Houston's own Smash United Perfect Light versus Gorilla. So this, this is going to be a melee classic, Sheik versus Falco. So I know of Gorilla, but I actually he hasn't entered recently. He only comes out to regionals. While Perfect Light attends, I think every Smash United. Uh, slash Houston event there yeah. is uh, going to both Smashdown Punk and No Fun Allowed. All right, so it looks like we're going to start it out here. Uh, really getting the classic pillar stuff. Now, what I really like to see from um, both players, specifically Gorilla, is a little bit more patience. Oh, Ooh, my gosh. Getting the roll in. And <laughs> what a call out. That was on that the very lip of the platform. Yeah. I think it was... Most definitely Perfect Light's fault because seeing that the forward smash was charged, you definitely yeah. have enough time to react and not get hit by that. But it's kind of like the bug to the light now. It's like you just kind of have to go into it. And uh, Perfect Light misses up the B reverse on his up B. Cannot grab the left from behind. Yeah, definitely looks like he's in his own head, especially with losing that first stock. Mm -hmm. uh, not really the mentality that you need to have, but Ooh. I mean, really curious just how he's going to handle the situation overall. And he's definitely going for all of these crouch cancel down smashes, uh, trying to beat out Falco's either missed aerials. But with him going for down air so much, I mean, it's kind of a poor decision. Yeah, it's scary because if you're holding down, you can't crouch cancel down air. So, oh, he's going oh. for another hard dude here. Yeah. You can't crouch, crouch cancel down air, so it's going to be really scary here, like choosing when and where to crouch. Yeah. You go to up tilt into a forward air. It's classic sheet combo. Yeah. And definitely uh, catching him up on the wake up, one of the big things. Uh, Gorilla not really being uh, able to recognize the situation. I think one of the big things that Perfect Light definitely needs to do is just catch him on his double jump, especially just uh, the really high full hops. Oh, going for another hard read there. Yeah, I feel like that's how Gorilla's just trying to get his kills is with the charge smash attack because he's not really getting uh, your regular pillar combos from Falco. Well, it worked out so far pretty well, uh, but it seems like Perfect Light has made the adjustments necessary to uh, take the stock lead mm. at a pretty, pretty high percent deficit, but thankfully with a stock lead, it's not too scary. And light hit back air not really uh, working out. I would have gone for something like falling nair or uh, down air actually just to combo back into itself, especially at such a high percent and how heavy uh, she relatively is. Yeah, she's got the human weight, the human fall speed. Uh, probably would have worked out, but nonetheless. Oh, okay. So, good needle. Good needle, snipe out on the double jump. And possibly a fade in would have been necessary. It still looks like Gorilla not really knowing how to adjust to this down smash. There's nothing I can really say about that because it's the only thing that he's really going for. Expect uh, Instead of just calling out movement with like dash attacks. Uh, oh. Okay. Good forward smash to call out the ledge option from Perfect Light. It was a yeah. quick roll up. It's going to take the stock. Now, I really would like to see uh, Gorilla make some adjustments here. Stop. I would not go so hard in on a sheep like this one, especially when you got so many crouch canceling options, unless you are for sure the down air will work. Well, I mean, you still have so many options just to deal with Perfect Light on field, especially uh, things like Shine Grab just to make sure to get off him rather than him just let go and then down smash out of it. Uh, Ooh. Because if anything, you do have Shine, and specifically being Falco, I mean, you're always going to be uh, in frame advantage, especially oh, with the specific tech, and that was a really good motivator. I like the Shine fight. stall to beat out the, the needle, but stalled a little bit too long. Oh. And Gorilla says, I didn't like the Falco in that matchup. I'm going to go ahead and pick Sonic now. Now, here's the problem. Uh, Perfect Light. Uh, Playing friendlies a lot with Shanik, if the Houston Sonic main, and Shanik is no slouch. You really have to respect him based uh, on his mix-ups with Spin Dash. Uh, and and regardless of player level skill, it doesn't matter. Is as long as you're playing the matchup relatively often, you're gonna learn all the different kind of things that work on the character. So we're gonna have to see if Gorilla can make the adjustment here to. Uh, to really beat out this perfect light down smash. So, how do you feel about them going to Battlefield? Do you think there's a... Uh, it's kind of questionable because Sheik loves Battlefield, but I definitely also think that Sonic probably does pretty well against on Battlefield as well. Um, 
I don't know. I'm not too opposed to it, but I think that the ground game that uh, Sonic has with like spin dash, crowd cancel, and then getting grabs, I, and not really having a particularly really great uh, platform game, it's really gonna hurt. Especially if Perfect Light just like stays on platform, camps him out with needles, and then goes off of uh, things like shield drop if Gorilla ever tries to go and contest him while he's still on platform. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. I suppose you're right. I would think that Sonic would probably want as least platforms as possible considering that his dash dance game is so strong. And that's one of the reasons why we see players like uh, Zeus uh, go a lot for things or stages like Smash Build. Because flat, you do have a dependable platform, but you can't always opt to it all the time. It has uh, relatively good blast zones just so you can kill him off the side. And. It really tests out their reaction time based on Zeus's positioning, but that's not really something that we're seeing really from Gorilla. Uh, he's just taking it step by step pretty slowly on what he wants to do. And that is going to be the second stock taken here for Perfect Light. We're going to get a tech chase situation done, but uh, Gorilla makes some quick moves to get out of it. Oh, nice dash chance. We're going to go for up there. So, really good 40% bolt off from Perfect Light, uh, especially since. Seeing that Gorilla was standing still, if you opted for just Aerial Needle into Boost Grab, something that you're going to really see from a lot of melee players as well, uh, just to make sure you can grab them while they're still in that relative hit stun from, uh, from Needles. Oh, and a missed ledge guard opportunity stolen away from Gorilla. Now we are on a 103% deficit, but it's definitely doable. Oh, he goes for the spike. Just messes it up. That's, oh, still has his up. And it was good because Perfect Light uh, is still expecting it, especially since he can still recover out of spent dash. He just has to jump cancel it. So, uh, great awareness. I mean, it's just very good Sonic fundamentals. Uh, a lot of things a lot of people really don't know about this character, especially since him not being in a lot of other uh, Smash iterations, except for Smash 4. Oh, we're gonna record it. Oh, oh, nice dash chance to bet out the grab. Unfortunate uh, lack of follow from the up throw, yet we will get out the. Oh, okay. The rogue mare. And when it. Oh looks, my, nice moonwalk in the back air to take out the stock. Uh, one of the things that we're. that I'm noticing from Gorilla specifically is that in neutral, when he's going for dash dance into just a relative aerial, he's really over adjusting and missing the actual hit. That up B going straight onto the platform is going to take it for Perfect Light. Yeah, that was a very solid, slow, fundamental win from Perfect Light. There's nothing really mm -hmm. going on. No mix-ups in play either. I like the change from Gorilla, but I don't...